Ladies and gents, welcome to the Gaming Apocalypse. I'm Wraith, and this is Ghost of a Tale. Before we jump back in, just a quick reminder, you are awesome. So, keep being awesome to others, okay? Alright, let's jump in and see where we are this time, shall we? So, as promised last time, I've just been kind of killing some in-game time. Should be far enough along that our good blacksmith friend... Ah, oh, crap, I forgot. I'm wearing the thief outfit and therefore can't do what I need to do. Uh, see if that's enough to break the outfit disguise. But anyways, he should be done with my armor. Yeah, how's it going with my armor? Just finishing up now. As good as it's going to get. Alright then, is there anything more you wanted? Uh, yeah, actually. I'm curious about something. Some items of clothing. Costume for a king. Can help you with that. Six florins, I'll put you on the right path. Okay. Many a noble rat. Right. Ceremonial occasions. Ooh. Could you make me a crown? I'll need gold. Seven nuggets at least. Seven nuggets of gold. Okay. Yes. I have the gold for the crown. And the quality's not great, but it'll do. All right, your majesty, give me six hours and you'll have your crown. Okay. Uh, no. Not right this minute. Oh, I forgot. I'm too close to him. Ooh, I can kind of run now. Noise! Armor's been upgraded. Heck yeah. Okay, and not only has this armor been upgraded to the point where we can go off and do what we gotta do, which means now I can start talking to guards and see... Eh, prisoner on the loose. Keep an eye out for him. I will. I don't know what you're up to, but you'd be wise to forget about it. I uh, best get on then. Uh, what about you? I'm just gonna ask random guards about this. At the center dwells the queen. I'm surprised. I suppose the master wants his tithe here. I've left it in the same place as usual in my footlocker. Well, alrighty then. Thank you very much, sir. You're a bit of an idiot, but that's alright. We, we like it when you guys are kind of stupid. Makes my life easier. I talked to that guy. What about you? Elevator gate guard. Hey! Heck yeah. What is it you need? Already? Feels like it's only been a few weeks since the last pickup. Alright, here. Tell the master I'll make up a shortfall next month. Okay. Okay. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Now, who would the last one be, though? That's going to be the real hard question to answer. Who's going to be the final one? Uh, I've already emptied that one. That one's already emptied. That one's already emptied. That one wasn't. Nice. That. Uh, nope. Don't have the right key for that one. That's okay. I assume that'll be the last guard that I have to find. Nothing there. That one's empty. Is there one over here? Yes. 
got his name. Let's head on back, shall we? So, I wonder if it'll be one of the ones, maybe the gambler? But one of the guards that's up there in the cooking area. Possibly. Or possibly not, I don't know. I'm kind of just making it up as I go, but we have to go back up there to talk to Silas anyways, so let's stop off at the commissary along the way. It's, well, it's not exactly along the way, but it's close enough. Yeah, because instead of going there, we just go around right here. Hey there. Oh, fine, fine. Well, you're an idiot, but all right. Aren't you here? Somebody be on duty here during meal times. Very wise. Ah, okay. So. He's just up here to deal with trouble. Uh, it's none of my business. Make plenty of games. Okay, that's fair. So he's not one. He knows about it, but he's not one. Is there anything else inside of here I could steal, maybe? It's a strong box. I still want to know what's in the strong box bothers me that I don't know. Also, just because I can, burn that. Not like anybody will ever know. The other two guards that were here are gone. I can't steal the pie, which sucks. Can I steal that bottle? I can. Excellent. Rearm ourselves with bottles. <laughs> and then go up there and talk to Silas. Actually, while I'm thinking about it. that sucker on fire too because honestly why not you know it's free xp as long as i don't get found let's see is silas awake yet he should be Some more light in here, bud. Hello. Hey, you're awake. How you feeling? Been up in that cell since, well, you made the tonic? Eh, the cook did. Not well, looking for your scabs. In the commissary, I said some things I shouldn't have. Looking for in that bottle. Murder of Crows, the song, I'm sure you must know it. Please sing it for me. All right. It's what he's asking for, so. 
do I just let it go or skip? I found the true nature of creatures is shown in the names by which each is collectively known. I've heard tidings of magpies and seen murders of crows. Smell the surfeit of skunks with a peg on my nose. It's probably the best way to smell them. Met a mischief of mice who are masters of prose. And a sneaking of weasels who relied on their toes. Clever. But the rats are the worst, as well everyone knows, because a gathering of rats is a plague as it goes. And now that's off my chest, I have this to propose. That they're creatures of whom I suggest we dispose. Okay, that's kind of ballsy to sing that in this world, but alright, sure. Your version, version is tamer than the one I know. Okay. Pops in my village used to sing it. I remember I thought it was funny. I liked the way the words rhymed. Didn't realize they were singing it to me. Not until my Oma chased them off with a stick. Oma. Then... You were raised by mice. Your birth parents, what are them? I often wonder about them. Who were they? What became of them? I may have had some gray in her coat. Her memory wasn't what it once was. She told me what she could. All the same, it wasn't enough. And then on the day I left for Yuva, a finely engraved silver band he'd shown you at the brazier's side. Mama gave me this silver ring. From your true mother, she said. She left with my Uma to help pay for my keep, but Uma wouldn't part with it. I was so angry with her for keeping it from me. I should have known it was for my own good. Hmm. How did that ring lead you? A few months before my discharge from Ratguard, I found a second silver ring. Found others, the ring, Gusto and Fatal. Stole. I have eight now, all told. Eight rings and this silver scroll case. Scroll case, the puzzle. What was it you found in there? A message from my father. Here, read it. Okay. A prayer scroll. Master of the Salamander, I offer you this ring, the relic of noble kings of old. May you accept it in tribute to your grace and as a promise to return what I have took this day. Warden of the Flame, guardian of lost hope, grant me courage to persevere and strength enough to prevail for my kingdom, my kind, for Brindis, my one true love, and Silas, my firstborn son. Okay, I'll see you Say you. Yeah, so just from your father. That's a prayer to the hero doing that. Aye. My father was Roderick, the last Rat King. Hmm. Roderick's son makes me the son of a coward. Shame. The red pile. Yeah. Makes sense. They would have tried to take out the air. What was it that he took from them? down there? Uh, will you keep searching for it? Why, I found it. Okay, well, that's fair. Did you reclaim your throne? Mongrel son of the Coward King. <laughs> yeah. The singing stone is lost. That's why you're soused. It sparks something in you. You hum to yourself the first few notes of a new lay, the Ballad of the Orphan Prince. What is it with you? Uh, 
about it in the commissary. Do you know the name of the doe who took Mara's place? No, but she had a son named Tan. It's not enough. You can't send out a scout without the full name. Ziva's going to start asking questions. What about the ship she's meant to be on? The Wrath Scallion. Fetch my logbook. It's on the table downstairs. Thought you might need it. Alright, let's see. Part of a general news dispatch received on the 13th. Prison transport arrived here on the 12th. Scanlon was reported lost in the cloak of Periclave. need to hear it. On the twelfth day, the Wrath Skellen, crewed by nine, laden with sundries and carrying twenty-seven prisoners, was reported late by the harbor master at Orondas, vessel last seen by the bosun of the Emerald Hind, off course and heading into the cloak of Paraclave, and so is pronounced lost. Mara is gone. I mean, waters are freezing. Valian frog wouldn't last more than a few minutes. Passing ship. Perhaps pirates. Tilo, I'm sorry. Even if you were alive, there's no way to trace Mara now. May as well ask a magpie. Actually, I, I think I know where to find one. Magpies will only speak with noble creatures and kings. To them, anything less is a meal. And I'll become a king. Here then, a scarlet tunic. Finished with gold piping and fine beadwork. Nice! A gift from my father. It's incredible. Where'd you find this? Hope we make a worthier king than he ever was. Nice. Tilo, what's wrong? Lost your nerve? Uh, perhaps this isn't important. But I've got your spyglass. Let's see what else is in there. Uh, all the scat beetles come home. Old clothes chest downstairs in the cot. Take a look through it, you might find something your size. Okay. Cool, cool. Since this isn't important, uh. It's a sinner dwells the queen. Oh. No, but I'm not blind to what's going on. I would leave this all well. Loan if I were you. If, if you were me, I wouldn't have this problem. Towards Harem. Took his place as Foss's assistant, so you're now part of it. Turn myself in. Careful, I'm sorry I can't help you more. Eh, it's fine. Uh, nope, there's nothing else there. Yeah, what are the what are up with the rings? Famed tail rings of the Rat Kings, a record of secession going back to the time of the Green Flame. Oh, I never understood their significance. Why they'd been left with the Wardens of the Green Flame. Not until I opened the scroll case you found. Okay, the second ring. Where, where did you find it? Uh, yeah, sure. How, how'd you find it? Signed to a convoy escorting the Baroness from Pesa to the capital. The fourth night we made camp at the Temple of Karam. The 
Guardian of Travelers. The temple's almost in ruins now. Been there with Mera, but we weren't allowed in. I was ordered to escort Baroness to the reliquary so she could offer Karam prayers. What's it like? It's seen better days, but Karam's remains are still there, laid out in an open sarcophagus at the head of the temple. It's as the Baroness knelt before the altar that I saw it, ring almost identical to my mother's, hung on a chain around Karam's neck. So they were almost identical. The design engraved on the second ring was different. It made me wonder if there weren't more of them waiting to be found. So there so there were. You stole it from a corpse? Uh, I mean, that, that's kind of grave robbery, but... I'm talking to ghosts now. Now I know you're full of it. Okay, fair enough. Other rings have been discovered. Tombs and temples of the Wardens of the Green Flame. Some have been stolen, some lost. It's taken me years to track them down. Okay. Why are you discharged? Served five years. My time is almost up. Soldiering somehow came easily to me. Something I was good at, so I re-enlisted. Besides, Redpaw has access to places civilians can't go. It's how I found the second ring. Okay, fair enough. Cool. So now I need to go back and find the magpie. I also need to figure out where the heck the fifth smuggler is. I said to go look through his chest. Well, there's a couple of fate cards. There's some hats. Because you can never have enough hats. Am I right? Cool. Very fancy hat. A peasant's fleet. And a style of hat popular amongst the peasants. Okay. Intriguing. So I need to get the crown from the blacksmith. Where he's making that. Uh, I guess I need to go talk to Fatal, find out what's going on with her, and I need to find this fourth smuggler, as well as the master's identity. Yeah, okay. I do like the fact that our armor moves a lot more efficiently now, compared to how it was originally, that was terrible. I'm really glad that I sank the time and effort into getting the armor, you know, streamlined. Okay, hop out here. Uh, let's go talk to a couple more guards, shall we? I talked to him already. I already talked to this one, right? Yes. And he was one of them. That's not the way I need to go. It's over here. This is the way I need to go. There's a couple of guards through here. I don't know if any of them will be the one that I need to talk with, though. Guard. Still not been found. Stay alert. Could be anywhere. Anything? No, no, don't say it. Okay. Fair enough. Interesting response to that, so I don't think he's one. Uh, what about you? Oh, you just straight up don't want to talk. It's a word of warning. We keep to ourselves around here. It doesn't pay to ask too many questions in Dwindling Heights. I can't help you. Okay. Fair enough. So you know what's up with it, but you're not willing to talk about it. That's cool. Huh. Okay. Can't do anything with her. That's annoying, but fair. Um, there is another guard over here. 
I wonder if he'll be one. Told you this gate is closed. Yep. Center dwells the queen. Let's go. So you're the new recruit. Listen, I've lost my footlocker key. Dropped it in the commissary, I think. Hoping the cook has just put it aside somewhere. If it falls in the commander's hands or the master finds out, well. Alright, don't worry. Well. I'll get it back for you. And by get it back for you, I mean totally not steal it and use it myself. <clears throat> <clears throat> yep, def definitely. And I bring it right back to you. Like I should. You can definitely count on me. Interesting. Well, nothing else we now know who the smugglers are. Let's go get ourselves a key, shall we? box key. Well, I don't have the strong box key, unfortunately. Not for a lack of trying, of course, but... see a key lying around in here anywhere. I do not. Drat. Now that I'm thinking about it, give me my lantern. Lantern's better at spotting stuff anyways. Supper is it? Have anything to report? You missed a food fight in here earlier. Darn. Stabbed the fresh carrot. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Imagine getting into a fight and your only weapon is a carrot. So you actually straight up stab somebody with it. Oh, that's good. It's 11.39, okay. It's gonna be a little while before the cook shows up again. Hmm. Where is there a bed at that I can get to? I'm sure there's one around. I just have to remember where that I could be at. Else I can drop down and grab another candle to replace the one that I burnt up earlier. I seem to remember there being a spare bed in one of these towers out here. Possibly. I should be able to just use that. Oh my god, it got really dark. Uh, was it in this tower? No, it was not. Different tower. I'm sorry, Mario, but the princess is in a different castle. Who remembers those fun times? Ah, crap, I'm in the wrong area. Well... 
Whatever, I guess I will just kill some time off camera again. Alright, well it looks like we have to find the, you know, wait around until the commissary opens back up, so to speak, so that we can talk to the cook. So, that's not the end of the world. I'll take care of that off camera and bring you guys back in when the cook is, you know, back in the area. So, anyways, we definitely made some good progress this time around. Uh, all the stuff with Silas, which is kind of crazy sounding, really. You know, Silas is actually, like, descended from a king. It's, it's pretty insane stuff, realistically. But, anyways, we'll find out more about it next time. So, if you enjoyed the video, as always, give it a thumbs up. Help keep the YouTube overlords happy. If you want to find out what's going to happen next, well, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. That way you know when I'm releasing new videos. Till next time, thanks very much for watching. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And remember that life does get rough sometimes. So, good luck. Have fun. Stay awesome. I'll catch you in the next one.